Hi guys, today I'll be showing you how to lay down a checkered flag design. Now there are several ways of doing this. Um, this is the way I like to do it best, uh, just because I think it comes out um, a bit better. Uh, we'll be using transfer paper uh, to mask out our design. Now transfer paper is just um, a, an adhesive paper, uh, it's low tack. Uh, this is what uh, sign makers use to transfer uh, vinyl onto their surfaces. Now this works out great because um, it doesn't really, uh, it, it's not very uh, sticky so it won't pull off paint and you can actually draw on it. Okay. And um, like I say, there are several ways of doing this. You can mask out with fine line, etc. But you normally get a gap between um, the the edges. Okay. So this is the way I like doing it, and I will show you how it's done. Okay. So we start off by masking our area and now we can draw our design directly on here okay now there's a rule to checkered flags the, the most important rule is or I'd say one of the most important rules is you have to have at least three uh, checkers to make it look good. If you have two then it just looks silly. Okay, So bear in mind the size of your uh, project and and then draw it out. There we go. Now I like to start off uh, with a black base but it's your choice you can start off with black and then do the white or vice versa or use whatever colors you like so now we're going to grab our exacto knife and we're going to cut out the squares that we want um, to paint white okay Now what I do is I score just through all the lines and then peel off the ones that I want black or white actually in this case. Okay so now we just pull the ones we want white. Okay, so now we've pulled out, we've uh, weeded out our design, um, which basically is, means <coughs> peeling out the squares that we want white. Now we just spray some white over it. So that's what we end up with okay now you can come in and shade it in or leave it like that is fine now you will um, occasionally get some spots where uh, it bleeds through so try and press it down and the masking down as best as you can to avoid it can be fixed not a big problem but So that's our design. Now I actually had masked out some other parts that I wanted to keep. 
that I had already done or worked on. Let's see how that turned out. Okay, not too bad. So just keep working on it. Blend it in a little more and that's it. So hope that helps. Um, any questions just comment below. Um, please like and subscribe and I will catch you soon.